Moving averages are one of the oldest and most widely used techniques for analyzing financial markets. They are so common that full-time traders working on institutional trading desks or part-time traders generate signals by moving averages every day. A simple moving average, or MA, appears as a colored line on a price chart. The line represents the average price over a certain number of periods. The number of periods depends on the MA's length. In the case of a 10-day MA, it is calculated by averaging the closing prices of the last 10 days. Each time a period ends, the MA is recalculated using the new close price and a fresh plot is recorded on the chart. Here is how you add an MA on the FX Trade platform. Click Add Study. Select SMA. Choose your desired MA length and click to add it to your active chart. Repeat this process as many times as necessary to add the desired number of MAs to your chart. In the midst of fast-paced trading environments, financial market professionals need to make confident and informed decisions, and the MA is a useful tool for aiding in this decision-making process. An important characteristic of the MA is that it irons out prices' minor ups and downs and helps to reveal the underlying trend. There are many types of moving averages, from the simple MA through to the more advanced exponential and weighted moving average. The simple MA is usually the go-to choice for traders. Moving averages can be of any length, and traders often experiment with different lengths. However, the commonly used MAs are the 10, 20, 50, and 200 period MA. The shorter the MA, in other words the 10 or 20 MA, the less the MA lags current price action, whereas the longer MA, the 50 and 200 MA, the more it lags current price. Due to the MA being such a widely watched indicator, these lines can indicate areas of major interest from both buyers and sellers. This intense interest by market participants means that MAs can act as levels of support and resistance. This means if price touches the MA, it can consolidate or bounce at that level. Some short-term traders take advantage of this tendency by opting to scalp the bounce. Moving averages have many uses. Some traders wait for pullbacks into an area between the 10 and 20 MA during strong trending markets, as this area often indicates a good place to open positions in the direction of the dominant short-term trend. In the medium term, traders and investors with more of a longer-term view are alert to signals given by the 50 and 200 day MA. If price falls below or rises above these MAs, this could be a sign the immediate or long-term trend has changed. A common strategy often learned by new traders is to have two MAs on a chart, one longer and one shorter. Every time the shorter MA crosses above or below the slower MA, a trade is signaled. Before implementing a strategy in your trading plan, you must fully understand the risks associated with trading the financial markets and always use a risk management plan. The Moving Average, a simple but effective tool used by traders the world over.